been feeling so small Watch the clock ticking off the wall But tonight I'm letting it go Spend my coin for sure Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and another taste test We are taste testing Nutramino today I don't know yep. if that's the correct way to say it But it's a, it's a Swedish brand Danish the, it's, a, it's a Danish brand <laughs> I meant to say Danish. If you're from Scandinavia, I bet you might have seen these. I think maybe I saw these on a UK site. As oh well, yeah, I yeah. think I might be mistaken. I think they have a bunch of stuff. I um, today saw that they have like sports drinks and uh, protein shakes. Uh, I think they also have protein powder, if I'm not mistaken. Oh yeah, yeah. I think I've maybe seen that. Yeah. But those shakes look good. Though. Yeah. Yeah. Really and these look really good. Yeah. They have so many different types of protein bars, like protein bars, wafers, and like different uh, names and like um, deluxe and XL and stuff. <laughs> so we're we're excited to test these out. We have had these for quite a while, so yeah, we're due for a test on them. And these are actually pretty decent uh, protein wise. Yeah. I think most of them are twenty, but these big ones, the XLs, are thirty grams. Oh yeah, that's so that's actually quite a, a decent amount of protein. Yeah, and yeah. the wafers look very promising. They do. Yeah. They, they look This like... one looks like a Hanuta and it smells like a Hanuta. Oh, really? Oh my god, it does smell like that. Oh, oh, shit. Okay, we, we just want to get right yeah. to it. We're starting with the XL protein bar in chocolate. And these are the ones that, had thir that has 30 grams of protein. Yeah, and it says specifically after workout. Thankfully, we've worked out. Oh, that's a bit grainy, isn't it? I thought it was good and like fudgy, but not that much flavor. And no. I thought that's a pretty basic protein bar. Yeah. Very basic. Not much texture at all, just like chewy. Yeah, it's got that uh, like basic protein bar, like um, grainy mass yeah. kind of. I didn't feel it was that grainy, but I do think it was quite like plain in the yeah. texture. For, for it to be like a chocolate flavor, it didn't taste too like too chocolate. No. There is a chocolate flavor though. Yeah. But I think that is, I, I usually say that, like old school protein bars used to taste like that. that. Yeah, that's an old the, school protein bar. Yeah, it was good. Yeah. It was just not more than good. But I don't think I would buy it again though. No. Because there's so many other kinds I would buy. So maybe a six and a half. I'm getting a bit of seven. Okay. Next one is the XL uh, protein bar in caramel. And it has a very much lighter inside. Oh yeah, you can actually smell like a slight hint of caramel. It has some like crisp pieces, but it looks like it's almost a mistake. It's so few of them. Oh yeah. It has so okay. few that it doesn't look like it's supposed to be there. Mm. This one reminds me of, oh, actually, now I'm getting the, the caramel flavor. Mm, I got the caramel flavor. Yeah, it's, it, it kind of creeps. It takes a while to show up. There, I, I think it was really good. Mm. Just the flavor was really subtle. Good it wasn't like a, too artificial or sickly. No. So I'm gonna give that, uh, I get that seven, I'm gonna give that uh, seven and a half. I'm giving that seven then, because I would pick it over that one. Yeah, I would pick that one yeah. as well. Uh, next one is the just protein bar, it's called, and it's chunky peanut and caramel. Ooh. And this is the plus indulge me range. <laughs> I don't know what that means, is but it, it looks like a Snickers. Oh yeah. It Ooh. has very light center with caramel, uh, a caramel layer and crisp pieces and peanuts. Actually, that does look indulgent. Yeah. Not that much flavor. No. For it to be like peanut butter and caramel, I think it lacked both. Mm -hmm. Yeah, awesome textures, like all the textures together. Yeah, that was that good. Was, that was good. I wouldn't call it chunky. I'm thinking like when I when I hear chunky, oh, well, my, that's probably something to do with my expectations. But I'm thinking like uh, Reese's not outrageous. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's chunky. <laughs> but it's almost like half peanuts in it. I guess that's yeah. I mean, that's why. But the uh, peanuts uh, didn't taste too much. But it, it, the flavor was was good. It was just it could be more flavor. But yeah, it's the same amount of flavor uh, as the last one. Yeah, so I'm gonna give it as. Seven. Seven and a half. Next one is protein bar creamy caramel. Yeah, and that's also in the indulge me thing. Yeah, I feel like you take a risk by putting indulge me in. Yeah, I know, you're kind of setting up some expectations. I like Ooh. the caramel flavor on that one. Yeah, it's kind of like um, 
a lot sweeter mm -hmm. than the other one. That one was uh, really nice. Mm -hmm. I thought that, that was one really good, good f flavor. I would put some salt on it, I think. Yeah. Because the caramel wasn't salty, but oh. it was really good. Yeah, I would still love maybe a little bit more, but that was really good. I'm gonna give that an eight. I'm giving it an eight as well. No, seven and a half. Okay. I'm sticking to the uh, one and a half. I think seven and a half. Okay. I am very excited for the next one because this sounds really promising. It's the protein bar, indulge me as well, in fluffy marshmallow and raspberry flavor. Ooh. That sounds very Ooh. intriguing. And it has, but I don't see like any red pieces in it. it smells good though. You smell the raspberry. Mmm. Oh yeah. That's soft. That's really soft. That reminds me of like raspberry candy. Mm hmm but it's exactly like raspberry candy. Nothing like a raspberry though. No, and definitely no marshmallow. No. I, I well, marshmallow doesn't really taste much except for sweet. But yeah, it was I, sweet. Yeah, it was nice and sweet. But I, I can't get any marshmallow out of it unless if that's what made it like soft. But it had a really good raspberry flavor. I don't think uh, like artificial raspberry has ever been bad. No. It's only good artificial yeah, yeah. flavor, so I um, like that. I think that gets a seven and a half. Yeah, I'm, th I'm thinking. Oh, not eight. Okay, I, gave, I gave the last one seven and a half, didn't I? Yeah, okay. I'm. I eight. think maybe I'm gonna give that a seven and a half. Oh, so you would you would pick that one over that one? Or did you give that? You give you gave that an eight. I gave that an eight. Yeah. No, I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna stick with it. That's yeah. a seven and a half. Uh, I'm equally as excited about the next ones because they look insane inside. I mean, they look like monster yeah. Twix. They are also indulge me, oh, strangely really? enough, but they're very different and they're bigger and yeah, longer. that's totally different form and yeah. yeah. Also called protein bar. This uh, first one is crisp vanilla and caramel. Ooh. And just look at the the crisps. I mean, that's a lot of that's a lot. And of I crisps. love crisps, so I have high hopes. That's definitely um, artificial vanilla flavor. Yeah, I was gonna say, but I'm here for it. Mm -hmm. That's good. It's like vanilla candy. Mm -hmm. it, I, actually, it does taste like vanilla ice cream. Yeah, it kind of does. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's kind of got like, like vanilla and cream. Yeah, that was really good. Yeah, I like that. Just, I, I wish the crisps were more crispy because yeah. they were a bit chewy. They were a bit stale. Could be a lot more crisper. Yeah, but I think I think I would pick that one over that one, so I gave it a seven and a half. I'm gonna give that an eight. Okay. Next one looks uh, the same, but it, it also indulged me, and this is called crunchy chocolate and brownie. Mm. And I'm here for everything brownie. It has a ca caramel layer in there as well. Yeah. Oh, that's softer. Mhm. Mm Mm, it's a very sweet brownie. Mm -hmm. I wish it was more uh, like chocolate, like dark chocolate flavor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It. I don't get brownie flavor from it. Mm -hmm. It's kind of. Oh well, no. Yeah, no. No. It's very like sweet chocolate. Like yeah. Light chocolate. I wish it was a bit darker and a bit more like intense chocolate. Yeah. Flavor. I'm but gonna give that a seven and a half. Actually, seven. Seven as well. Next one. <laughs> uh, looks like a bounty. Yeah. Am I right in... It looks like, yeah, it is a coconut. Yes! It's the same, indulge me, and it's in sweet coconut, it's Ooh. called. Have you noticed that every single bar or chocolate or anything that is anything to do with coconut is blue? Yeah, always. Coconut is always, always blue. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone who got that reference, good on you. It takes a while oh, for yeah. the coconut flavor to, mm -hmm. to show up. I like the texture. It reminds me of... A protein version of Bounty. Yeah. Mm, but the flavor isn't sweet enough. Mm -hmm. It says, well, it, did, did it say sweet yeah, coconut? Yeah, it says sweet coconut. It, uh, it doesn't taste sweet coconut. It tastes like coconut. No. Uh, I it love... tastes a bit like pantry, I think. Yeah. Like a bit. Yeah, it tastes a bit old. Mm -hmm. Damn it. If that was, if, if, it, if it was just slightly sweeter. Yeah. And I had a fresher taste, but I mean, I'm gonna. I, I, it's coconut. I love coconut. It's six and a half for me. I think. Oh really? Because I wouldn't buy it again. I would try it again just to see if it tastes like cupboard. So I'm gonna give it seven. And a half. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> now we're on to the wafers, and I thought maybe we'd just do the plain chocolate first. Yeah, Nutra Go, they call it. Oh, it smells nice and sweet. This one's old. Bit of texture on it, like the wafer. 
The you didn't taste old, I think. No, uh, no, but more like the texture of it. Mm -hmm. But the wafer and the chocolate and the wafer texture experience, that was good. Yeah. Yeah, it might be a bit stale, but I, th I thought it was a good texture. Yeah. And good the, chocolate I, flavor. I just, thought, I just thought maybe I could have more flavor. Yeah. The flavor was good, I just wanted more of it. That's it kind of the theme overall. <laughs> yeah. But compared to some of the other ones, I think that one had more chocolate flavor. It yeah, it did, this one yeah. tastes more chocolate than the uh, chocolate brownie. Yeah, yeah, so it did. So I'm gonna give that. And um, I like that the the layer of chocolate in between is really like thick. Yeah, that that kind of makes it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give that a seven. I'm giving it a seven as well. I'm also very excited for. I'm, I'm excited for everything, but <laughs> the vanilla. When I saw that it had like these pieces Ooh. in it, I don't know what that is, but it just says vanilla. But this looks like like strutted cello or something. Yeah, it smells like good waffle. It's yeah. It really smells like vanilla. Oh, the pieces in it—they're really hard. Oh, I didn't get that. They're really hard, like the pieces inside. Oh, you're. But I, I, I didn't get that. I, didn't I don't get know that. if it, uh, that's a problem though. It's it's really good. It's it's the flavor exactly was like uh, good waffle. Good waffle. But that was damn good. Yeah. I, I, um, that was really good. That was better than the chocolate one. Yeah. I'm going to give that uh, an eight and a half. I'm giving it an eight. I definitely would buy that again. Yeah. If I'm going to have like a, um, a healthy dessert, maybe buy a Halo Top ice cream with that on top. Ooh. Okay, the last one. This is the wafer in hazelnut. Oh, this is the Hanuta. Yeah. And it has actually has hazelnut pieces in it as well. Oh yeah, it smells great. Mm -hmm. That's a very strong hazelnut flavor. I was gonna say it was quite subtle. Oh no, actually now, now it's coming. Yeah, but it's, just, it's, like, it's, oh, not, it's yeah. not maybe strong, but uh, like compared to the, the wafer, it, it's in. Yeah. It's kind of overpowering. Now it's, yeah, I, I didn't taste it to begin with, but now it's kind of getting the right. Yeah. It tastes like kind of hazelnut oil. Mm -hmm. It was good it though. Was, yeah. I just I don't think I would I would prefer the the, the vanilla one. Oh yeah, yeah, that's mm -hmm. yeah for sure that one. Yeah. So I'm gonna give that uh, what what did I give it? An eight and a half. I'm gonna give that a seven seven and a half. No seven seven. I think I'm gonna give that six and a half. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Okay, I don't know. Uh, I don't <laughs> remember what I uh, what I gave the highest score, but I think the the marshmallow raspberry. That's a winner for me. Okay, yeah. So I... that one and that one and the vanilla wafer. Those two are the winners. I think I'm gonna give it to the vanilla wa wafer and this one, the crispy vanilla caramel. Yeah. So I'm a vanilla person today. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> and not just because. <laughs> yeah, this was yeah. a good test. It was. Th was there any losers? Yeah, the first one. Yeah, that was. The first one and the coconut, I think. Maybe. I have to admit, maybe the coconut wasn't. Uh, I, I think I gave it a good. No, actually, I did give it seven and a half. Uh, no, I'm gonna stick with it. The losers for me is the first one and the brownie one. Okay. Yeah. We are interrupting the video with uh, a short uh, clip. We just found uh, another Nutrimino item at the, our gym, and uh, I haven't published this video yet, so we wanted to test it now and just put it into the video yeah we so. literally found it like 10 minutes after we finished filming the yeah. other one <laughs> <laughs> so we found the wafer in a coconut flavor so and that's what we wanted to test out and if you know anything about me we have to have that coconut yeah it <sighs> looks like um it looks like it might be like chocolate coconut because it's like light brown it smells like a really light bounty yeah It definitely smells more coconut than it tastes. It's very subtle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm getting more of the aftertaste of it. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna say this is really good. Mm -hmm. Had it been a tiny bit sweeter, mm -hmm. just a tiny bit. Should be a bit, just a tiny bit more coconut flavor. Yeah. Actually, I'm, I'm out of all the wafers. I think that's the one I enjoyed most, even more than vanilla. Yeah, I actually like that as well. Yeah. The the flavor with the like the wafer and the coconut together was good. Yeah, and I'm actually getting coconut flakes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think that was in the middle of it. Yeah. That was really good. Yeah, that was good. My okay. favorite. I'm glad we <laughs> bought that now. Yeah, same <laughs>
Okay, but I'm thinking, I'm still thinking maybe seven and a half. I'm gonna give it an eight and a half. It's been a couple of days since the last test, so <laughs> we might not be as able to compare, but. Okay, but that's it, back to the other test. <laughs> There you have it, if you're ever wondering how any of the Neutromino bars taste like. You heard it here first. Yeah, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and if you didn't enjoy it, give it a thumbs up. Yeah, motivation. Uh, yeah, subscribe if you haven't, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.